Yeah, some chicken breast fillet, you know, in barbecue sauce. I eat where I did it right here now, late for today cooking. But yeah, prepare the chicken breast you now, just don't season it up. But sure, a quick thing, we're not feeling the ace, as a ace, there's a quint, a quick process. Yeah, so as we go along, we'll show you what I'm going. Yeah, we're going to mash up some white rice with it. See it? Alberta rice, you know? You can't take the little dirty rice, them, although sometimes we might have to use them and we can't get them. Alberta had the grace pack, we just have to run to the ready mix in the shop. So, these are the rice, you know? I'll go in the pot. Yeah, take it to the next stage. So we're gonna wash rice. Yeah. Yeah. See. Wash rice to put on rice while we have the liquor. Chicken breast, what is that? Going to marinate a little bit. I don't know, we'll like in time. You bite piece of meat, your taste is seasoned in it. You see what I said? I'm just sorry, I never make up my mind when I did cook today. So I could have do the seasoning from the night before. But I already like Freddy right here now. So, so the step, we'll wash rice. So, continue the video from here. Yeah. Yeah, we had a pot pan fire now. Butter, chiffon margarine, you know? Yeah, cover our pot you now, rice is on. Get a little, the, a little more time, another five minutes to marinate some more. Then we get back to it and reach that stage there. Then we take on through the process. Yeah. Here we are now, we have the seasoning cut up, ready for the sauce, guys, you know. These type of things don't take too long, you know, because remember it's chicken breast, so, and told me, it, whether we, which way you go cook it, chicken breast is something that is easier to, 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 to get through the process, so. You got to prepare, you know, when you put on the potty, you know, here, you see, I cut up seasoning and then high hot and so you do all this thing first. So, yes, this is a seasoning. So, as I said, as we go along, you see the process of the barbecue chicken fillet. Yeah, we are preparing the flour. Yeah, slightly floured. The breast fillet just slightly not a lot of flour coating just slightly just to give that crunch to the the, 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 the breast fillet itself yeah so this is a little flour season up here yeah so they are having the chicken fillet yeah in the pot Catching its color, yeah, slightly, it's still slightly turned on because you don't want it to burn, you know. You want it to, to, to fry. Meanwhile, oil is going through the breast itself to steam the meat. Yeah, but it's not something you want to burn up. So you keep it on a, probably a low fire, depending on the time you have to spend, or a medium, you know, yeah. How quick you want it to catch that color you want. Yeah, it's golden brown look. Yeah, and you get a little crispy look. So you know when the sauce, the thickness in the sauce now, whoa. This is me chewing. So crispy and nice. And the sauce is not on it yet. Yeah. And the last one now. The last lap, I think I have one more set to put in. Yeah. And the rice, almost 
spin hot hot don't know why I was so big without holding it with a rod or something but that's what it goes in the kitchen sometimes you have to get burned yeah golden crispy so then chicken breast filler fillet yeah well this is the last lap and then we get down to the the sauce side which in making the sauce you don't want to use the same pot because you know the flour from the fillet you know kind of give the pot a little burn less stuff so you don't want when you're making the sauce the sauce have that bitter taste in it so what you're going to do if you're fortunate enough to have another pot which i do you probably strain the oil from this you can use fresh oil but where cost is concerned you can use the same oil you just strain the oil that the, the burn of the flow and stuff don't really go in the other pot yes to make your sauce so this is the crispy brown, brown chicken filet yeah brown and as i said this is what's going to make the sauce garlic honey garlic barbecue sauce yeah so stay tuned yeah so here we go we got a new pot on the fire because that oil was burnt so we didn't use back that oil so we use fresh oil and a new pot because as i said you don't want the 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 the, the sauce to have that bitter taste and you likely forget that bitter taste if the pot, the oil is burnt with the flour that you flour the, 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 the chicken with. So we're just going to get the season in now. And with the season in, you do a little stir fry. This is what I mean. So the season in. There's a lot of people because I watch a few vlogs <laughs> where I see people doing cooking up and they cooking like like salt fish or butter bean or salt fish with bean, bean whatsoever. What they do, they put in the meat kind first. But this is the proper way to do it. You get the seasoning to scald, which you scald the season in the aisle. So you get the flavor from the seasoning. Yeah. So when you get the seasoning to scald, you know, then you will see like the tomato, the honey, and goats. Dead instead, so look now, it is fresh. So, when it started to scald, you see it get dead. So, you know, your, your seasoning are scald. Yeah, you have a low flame because you don't want to burn the seasoning, you, know? you just want to have it a, a low flame. It keeps stirring in the higher, you know, like you stir frying, just not to make the seasoning burn. And then when you have this done now then my sauce will be added with a little drop of water to base it to the amount of sauce i want to need so you will see that soon yes people this is what the finished sauce look like and then this is like the sauce yeah see this is the sauce then we it's a possibility that after using the sauce, because the sauce would be used like a gravy to eat like the rice, this sauce. So you can just pour a little of this lightly over the meat itself. So if you don't want to dip in the sauce with the meat, you can take the raw sauce from this to eat. So you just, you just sprinkle a little, whether one side in the plate or just over the fillet itself. So I will show you the finished product in a few. So yes, people, 
this is the finished product I might shot a little vegetable because I was a little bit late not knowing what to look after but this is the finished product you understand chicken breast fillet in honey garlic sauce barbecue yeah and white rice so peeps just it's a new channel going to be out does like share and subscribe there's a lot of epic videos going to come out both and commentary cooking vlog anything you name it the channel name is speak my mind you might mainly get a lot of commentary and current things that's going on yeah so does you know speak my mind yeah just like, share, and subscribe.